today I'm going to read you a story called Draw Me a Star by Eric Carl. And here's a person drawing a big colorful star. Draw me a star. And so he's drawing a big blue star. And the artist drew a star. He's an artist, a person who draws and paints pictures. It was a good star. Look at that. It was brilliant with so many colors and so many pointy ends. One, two, three, four, five. Five pointy ends. Draw me a sun, said the star. And the artist drew the sun. It was so warm. Look at the big bright sun. Draw me a tree, said the sun. And the artist drew a tree. It was a lovely tree. Draw me a woman and a man. And the artist drew a handsome couple. Draw us a house, said the couple. And the artist drew a house. It was a very strong house. Draw me a dog, said the house. And the artist drew a dog. It was a big dog. Draw me a cat, said the dog. Draw me a bird, said the cat. Draw me a butterfly, said the bird. Draw me a flower, said the butterfly. And the artist drew red and yellow and blue and purple flowers. Draw a cloud, said the flowers. And the artist drew clouds heavy with rain. These are rain clouds, he drew. And look, it's raining and there's a rainbow and all this is drawn by the lovely artist. He drew and painted this beautiful picture. Draw me the night, said the rainbow, and the artist drew a dark night. Draw me the moon, said the knight, and the artist drew a full moon. Draw me a star, said the moon, and then he showed the moon how to draw a star. First you draw a line going down, and then you go over, and then you go left, and then you go right, and then you go up. And then a star, oh, so bright. It was a good star. Hold on to me, said the star to the artist. Then together they traveled across the night sky. There's the artist and the star. The and I hope you enjoyed this lovely story about Draw Me a Star. Perhaps you could draw a star, your very own star, just like the artist did. And he drew so many things in this story. Perhaps you could try drawing some of the things or all of them by yourself. So enjoy drawing. And hope you're inspired by this story. I'll see you again with another lovely story. Until then, bye.